Hi, I'm Mike Edwards. The website is diydoctor.org.uk. Um, Hi, I'm Mike Edwards. The website is DIY Doctor. Hi, I'm Mike Edwards. The company is DIY Doctor. Hi, I'm Mike Edwards. The website is diydoctor.org.uk. And uh, as you know, we are builders. And this is what we're trying to show in a series of projects is how to practice the things that you're going to do on your home. Um, today we're going to be laying some slabs which are going to form a path um, up the length of the garden. Some bumps here, there and everywhere. Overall it's an average couple of millimetres thick and this is how it's going to stay for five or ten minutes. Correct safety equipment, don't forget the ears. Simply by using a spirit level and moving that about over the wall and if it's touching in mo most places you've got fairly flat and level walls. 87,000 people. This isn't funny. Why are you laughing? How to, how to repair holes and cracks in walls. We show you how to hire those tradesmen. The questions to ask them, the contract to get them to sign, the answers that you should be getting so that when that guy starts work on your home he's definitely not a cowboy. So holding the slab in the corner, I'm going to drop that into place, up again. This, ladies and gentlemen, after six or seven minutes of research, is a bunny template. It's called a hammer fixing. Um, some of us would call it a frame fixing. Um, and it's used for fixing timber or well, mostly timber to be honest, um, it doesn't work so well with, with metal, but mostly timber to masonry surfaces. Mike Edwards is a DIY doctor, very much at home, with a pair of pliers in his hand, although he's forgotten them this morning, he's here. And so Looking at some tools that have been sent us uh, so that we can test them and tell you how, how good or how bad they are. A very useful little tool, and I'll run through it with you uh, as we go. So we found this little device, it's called an eddy uh, descaling device. Uh, Here's this little beauty, this is called a mag welder, so that's metal active gas, um, MAG. 15,000 people sawed themselves, 6,500 ground themselves in some way or another. It's that the trigger itself comes obviously with a length of hose, small high pressure hose, um, and you simply push the hose into the outlet and tighten the locking nut into place as you can see me doing there. Of the driver, up pops the rest of the shaft. So you have an ordinary screwdriver, but it gets better. 6,000 hammered themselves, 4,000 chis chiseled themselves, 3,500 screwed themselves, 3,000 drilled, <laughs> dr <laughs> drilled themselves, and 2,000 axed themselves into hospital. I watched your program on the telly and you plastering over Artex on the ceiling. I did it, but you didn't say it went hard quick and my trowel is stuck in the lumps on the ceiling. It was a surprise, now it's expensive I think. Please help. So this is the gate valve um, from the cold water supply to the hot water tank or immersion heater or in this case and immersion heater there's not always an immersion involved but this is the hot water tank now it's time to show you about the bunny launcher itself and what had happened is bless her her, her son had broken his leg and he was halfway through his mock gcse's and his little his study in his bedroom he had one of those computer desks and because he had his leg was in a cast, he couldn't get close enough to the keyboard. So she wanted to drill a hole in the side of her computer desk to stick his leg through so he could carry on typing. Um, that's initiative, we love it. That's brilliant. And launch the bunnies. One, two, three, launch! <laughs> and that's how we do things at DIY Doctor. Thank you.